or high. Honas, the second largest and to value the city of Lithuania, the administrative center of the Konas district, in 1919-1940, the temporary capital of the Republic of Lithuania. The name of the city is built to the Baltic root cow meaning the low, fenny, marshy place, or bring out of the Lithuanian name Konas. Such surname still meets in Lithuania. Someone was Konas, it is a known, it is considered that it could be the governor of the Lop. Before restoration of independence of Lithuania in 1918, the city was called Kovno or Kovna, a traditional Slavic form of the name. It is for the first time mentioned in 1030. I was a part of Zematia. The first mention in Chronicles belongs to 1361 when the Great Connors Castle was constructed. In 1362 the lock was captured after a siege and destroyed by the Teutonic Order. It was one of the largest and important military victories of Teutonic Knights in the 14th century Mines Lithuania. The Connors Castle was reconstructed at the beginning of the 15th century. In 1408 the city acquired the Magborg right from Vitovd Veliki and in 1413 became the center of the Konas County in the Trakeski Voivodeship. The power self-government of Konas was divided between three main interconnected institutes. Vetus Mayor Two magistrates Twelve German and four burgomasters and so-called court of the bench. Twelve people. Connors began to gain popularity as was on crossing of trade ways and river port. In 1441 Connors entered into Hanseatic Alliance. The trade mission office of Hansa, the only thing in Grand Duchy of Lithuania was open. The city of the beginnings played an important role in the economy of the region of the Baltic Sea and Grand Duchy of Lithuania. In the city the first school, public hospital, drugstore was constructed, its importance as center of trade with Western Europe and Riverport grew. In 1657 and 1708 in Connors plague stormed. In 1731 and 1732 the fires destroyed a part of the city. 17 backslash the 18th century Grand Duchy of Lithuania fell into decay. As a result of the third section of the Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth in 1795 the city was a part of the Russian Empire. The economic situation gradually improved, but in 1812 during invasion into Russia Napoleon's army passed through corners and the city incurred serious destructions. The Kavensky province with the center to Kovno. Kones was formed in 1843. In 1862 the railroad connecting the Russian and German Empire that made Connors the important railway junction was constructed. To protect the western borders of the Russian Empire, Kavensky Fortress was constructed. In 1863, after the unsuccessful Polish-Lithuanian January Revolt of the Minding Russian Empire, the residence of the Bishop of Zemati Emotius Valentius was transferred from Varnier to Kaunas. Soon the Kaunas Theological Seminary became one of the centers of national revival of Lithuania during the Russification era. Seminaries, many of students, actively were engaged in smuggling of forbidden Lithuanian books. In 1884 students of seminary began to issue the Lithuanian newspaper Lituvalitis in the Lithuanian.
after World War I in 1919 when the capital of Vilnius was annexed by Poland, Konas became the temporary capital of Lithuania. The state is the city borrowed till 1939. The first president of Lithuania Antanas Mitona and all subsequent presidents of the interwar period worked in the presidential palace in Konas. In 1920 in Konas the constituent Simas of Lithuania which laid the foundation for the legislative system of the state was brought together. The Diet adopted a number of important laws, in particular about a land reform, national currency and adopted the new constitution. At the time of independence Konas expanded. The city was called Small Paris for his rich cultural and academic life, architecture and the widespread culture of café. The temporary capital had the western standard of living with rather high salaries. At the time skilled workers earned very similar real salaries with workers in Germany, Italy and France, and industrial production of Lithuania increased by 160% from 1913 to 1940. Konas was the biggest city in Lithuania and quickly grew. New suburbs were planned and built. In particular, the region of Shulyakalnis. The city extended from 18 to 40 square kilometers. In 1924 buses began to ply. In 1928 the water supply system is constructed. Three modern bridges through the Neris and Yamunas River are built. The big role in development of the city of time was played during this period by his burgomaster Junas Valacius. As a result Connors became the active participant of the European city life. The city was also a especially important center for armed forces of Lithuania. In January, 1919 during the Lithuanian Wars of Independence the Connors Military School which began to train soldiers was created. In May 1919 around Fred the Lithuanian State Aircraft Factory was founded to repair and supply army with military planes. And Connors began to make the Lithuanian Anba military plane. During World War II the advanced parts of the German troops in the evening on June 24, 1941 entered the city. Were transported through the river by the ship, the bridge through Neiman was blown up. Which was already cleared of the Soviet troops by groups of the Lithuanian Front of Activists. Of a, which excited a rebellion in the first day of war. By the evening approached Connors. Passing by airfield, saw tens of damaged and burned planes, the destroyed hangars and the takeoff field and funnels. At first on the bridge to Connors passed 188. By 21 o'clock the battalion of the Captain Rediak was also included into the city. However, didn't manage to pass all divisions of the 336 joint venture the bridge as it was blown up. An attempt of the 190th joint venture to pass the Po River to the destroyed bridge were fired. Machine gun and automatic fire was conducted with attics and from windows. From a church of Connors, three machine guns shot. At some commanders' families lived in the city on apartments. These commanders with separate groups of soldiers were transported to the city on makeshifts. Many dicks of families were killed hung up. Five forces Neiman on makeshifts and by swimming in aid, ten came to the southeast of Connors. Due to the lack of fuel and lubricants and ferrying means all heavy weapons and the equipment were destroyed. Veteran 5 Kanavalov, 10 years in fight. 
in corners which parts of the Red Army left there was no rocker connection for which the task would be set, to protect any objects, except for bridges through Neiman and a tunnel at the railway station. The Lithuanian militiamen who remained in the city tried not to allow on June 22 armed men on radio station which was occupied by agents of the 2nd Department of Anabasun. Parts of regular German army seemed in corners on June 25. The first order of the occupational authorities it was forbidden to organize honorable reception of the German army, any posters, nobody can be shown on the street at pass of the first parts. On August 1, 1941 to specify the government of Lithuania by order of the German military command and approved the provision on Jews, according to which Jews were recommended to live only in special areas of residence in ghetto. In Connors in Pol suburb. Earlier, Slobodka. Where forcibly occupied 30,000 Jews, the Connors ghetto was such area. On August 1, 1944, parts of the 5th Army of the 3rd Belarusian Front of the Red Army entered the city. For a difference in fights at liberation of Khan as the honorable name and Vany of Kavensky was appropriated to the 21st military unit, 13 military units were awarded with awards for release of the city and valor and courage shown at the same time. After restoration of the Soviet power in Lithuania, in corners and its vicinities guerrilla groups of Forest Brothers began the activity which was generally suppressed by 1953. On November 2, 1956, in day of all deceased true, in the city there took place the demonstrations of the Lithuanian youth which had anti-Soviet character which led to collisions with militia. Arrests of participants were as a result carried out. On May 14, 1972-19-year-old Romas Kalanta in protest at the Soviet power in Lithuania committed self-immolation near the fountain near musical theater on Laves to the Avenue. Freedoms It caused Massachusetts anti-Soviet protests which were quickly suppressed in the city. In the late 80s in corners the anti-communist movement amplified. On June 10, 1988 the local office of the Sidus organization was created and on October 9 the same year the colors of Lithuania were hoisted over a tower of the military museum Vitov Tvalikogo. On February 16, 1989, in anniversary of adoption of the Act of Independence of Lithuania of 1918, the Cardinal Vincent Slatkiovicius on a sermon in the Connors Cathedral for the first time called for separation from the Usa. After the termination of a Massachusetts in the downtown there took place the celebrations devoted to installation of a new monument of Svoboda on the place taken down after war by the Soviet authorities in which, according to some information, about 200,000 people took part. On March 11, 1990 Lithuania declared independence. During the January events of 1991, after occupation by the Soviet troops of buildings of radio and television in Vilnius, the only Lithuanian television program was broadcast from Konas. On August 31, 1993 the city was left by the last connections of Northwest Group of Troops of the Russian Army. In 1993, the new coat of arms of Connors was approved. The urban economy was gradually transformed to such services industries as logistics, transport, tourism and information technologies. In September, 1993, Connors visited, during the visit to Lithuania, the Pope John Paul II, having made a Massachusetts and having met youth at Stadium of Darius and Gerinas. 
About 30,000 people participated in a meeting. Natives of Conas Butadas Landsbergis and Valdas Adamkas became heads of state in 1990 and 1998. March 29, 2017, Connors was called the cultural capital of Europe of 2022. The heraldic press of Connors entered at the beginning of the 15th century during government of the Grand Duke Vitovt. Vitotus Lightus is the most old city heraldic seal known in the territory of Grand Duchy of Lithuania. On the city stamp seal since the 15th century a tour was represented, since the end of the 15th century he was added by a cross. Since 1843 the coat of arms of the Kavensky province represented the monument placed into Town Hall Square in memory of Patriotic War of 1812. On May 2. 1935 the City Council of Connors approved the coat of arms with the image on a purple background of a white tour with gold hoofs and a cross between horns. Since 1969 the coat of arms with the image on a red background of a white bison was used. The decree of the President of the Republic of Lithuania restored on June 30, 1993 a historical municipal coat of arms of Connors. On a red board, a white tour with a gold cross between horns. Connors also has the big coat of arms in which the ship, three gold spheres, and the Latin text of Diligit Justitium Qui Judicatis Terum is represented. The big coat of arms concerns Saint Nicolay, the patron of merchants and seamen whom Bond Sforts is queen considered the heavenly keeper of Connors. The city is located almost in the center of Lithuania, at confluence of the Neris River. Neris. To Niemen. Niemunes. Near the Connes Reservoir, in 104 came to the northwest from Vilnius. Connes rises approximately by 70 ATM above sea level. The highest point of the city is about 9 forts. 100.1 m. The lowest in the western part of the city, near the right coast of Neiman, the Lake Lampedus is located. The central part of the city is located between the rivers in an environment of three hills, Julia Kalnis, Alexotis and Shalanyi. The square of the city minus 157 km. Parks, gardens and reserves occupy 8329 hectares. In 1989 the population made 418,087 people, according to a general population census of 2001, 381,300, in 2004, 368,917. Dynamics of the population of the city of Kaunas throughout his history is given in the table. Apparently, increase in the population during the Soviet period due to migration of the Lithuanian peasants to the cities and some inflow of migrants from other republics of the Soviet Union was the greatest. In the past the city was more multinational. In 1897, according to a census, citizens specified languages. Jewish. Yiddish. Minus 25052, Russian minus 18308, Polish minus 16112, Lithuanian minus 4092, German minus 3340. In the Russian Empire, a part of Polonia's Irvani Lithuanian elite was considered as Poles, and names and surnames registered by Slavic tradition. From 1919 for 1939, the population of Kaunas doubled mainly due to growth of the Lithuanian population of the city. During the capital period of minority had the schools. 
Vikonas Real Jewish Gymnasium, Vikonas Private Polish Gymnasium of Adam Mikovich, Vikonas Real German Gymnasium, Vikonas Russian Gymnasium. The cultural organizations, bookstores, banks. For example, Society of the Credits of the Connors Poles, the Polish Bank, etc. Books in Yiddish, the Russian, Polish languages were published, there were newspapers. The Jewish newspapers, Jiddish Steam and Volksblatt. At the Connors University, the Department of Asemitologia, which was directed by Haim Nachman Shapira, worked. The writer modernist Eliezer Heyman was popular. Connors kept considerable number of architectural monuments among which, the Connors Castle, a town hall, Gothic Street, Peter's Basilica and Pavel, St. Mikhail Archangel's Church, Kavensky Fortress, Perkins House, etc. 26 libraries, 7 professional and 10 amateur theatres, 20 folklore ensembles work in the city. In Connors there passes the Connors Jazz Connors Jazz Festival and the Musical Festival of Classical Music Pass Haceless. One of the most considerable cultural events in Connors is City Day of Connors. The City Day is celebrated on May 20. This day in 1463, the Prince Casimir IV confirmed and expanded the rights of the city. The main festive actions take place within several days on streets of the old city near the Connors Castle. Some of the most outstanding sites of Connors. Laves Avenue, 2 km. Svoboda Avenue. The main city street along which lime trees are planted, and her continuation, Vilniuskaya Street conducting to the old city. Connors Castle, construction of the 14th century. Vitovta Church, one of the oldest churches of Lithuania and the oldest in Connors. St. Gertrude's Church in Connors. Church of the St. Martyr Georgi, the building in Gothic style. Cathedral of Saints Piat and Pavel, the biggest Gothic building in Lithuania with an interior in style of late Baroque. The Pasisliski Monastery, complex of constructions in Baroque style. St. Francis of Oregis Church. St. Mikhail Archangel's Church in the Neo-Byzantine style. The Tomb of the Unknown Soldier, Eternal Flame and Monument to the Lithuanian National Revival are located at Edinstva Square opposite to the Military Museum. Resurrection Church with a breathtaking panoramic view of the city. The Connors Zoo, the only state working zoo in Lithuania. Kavensky Fortress, one of the biggest defensive works of the 1920 centuries in Europe occupying 65 square, came. Since 1882 the ring of surf forts around the city was constructed. Only 9 forts, 12 batteries. After World War I fortress lost the military value. Connors Botanical Garden. Dam Banknota, Hill of Napoleon, Coral Synagogue, Perkunis' House, Connors Philharmonic Hall, Tan Hall, Inside Museum of the City, Observation Deck, and Tan Hall Square. Two funiculars in Julia Kalnis and Alex Otis. Mosque of Connors. The Lithuanian Ethnographic Museum under the open sky is located to the east from Connors on the bank of the Connors Reservoir in the city of Ramshishks. Connors Center of Cultures of the Different People. 
Oceanarium and Shopping Center, Mega. Taunas is often called the city of the museums for their abundance. The museums of Kaunas include Military Museum Vitov Tavilikogo The National Art Museum of M.K. General Jonas including works of the beginning of the 20th century of the vanguard author M.K. General Jonas which united painting and music in one work of art. The Museum Zujavichisa, better known as the Museum of Devils. The only museum of devils in the world which stores a collection from more than 2,000 sculptures and cut figures of devils from around the world, the majority of which national origin. Special interest is attracted by Adolf Hitler and Joseph Stalin's Devils Together Dancing Dance of Death on Human Bones. Connor's Art Gallery Art Gallery of M. Zelinskis In gallery works of art from ancient Egypt to Impressionism, samples of the Chinese and Japanese porcelain are collected. Among European graphic art is Jose de Ribera, Arnold Bioclin and Rubens's works. Museum of the Holocaust in Nine Fort. Lithuanian Air Museum. Museum of the Lithuanian Literature of Maronis. Museum of History of Medicine and Pharmacology of Lithuania. The historical presidential palace showing exhibitions of the interwar period. The Connors Museum for Blind People. Museum of the Lithuanian National Musical Instruments of Povila Stulgi. Zoological Museum of Tadas Ivanaskas. Sugikaras House Museum. Museum of Ceramics. Museum of History of Communication Museum of Links and Resistance of the Soviet Occupation Its so-called underground printing house AB was a part of the press of the movement of nonviolent resistance in the period of the Soviet Union. Today this division of the Kaunas Museum of War located in 8 kilometers to the north from Kaunas in the small village of Saliu, near the city of Damikava. Despite regular work of AB Printing House, she wasn't found by KGB. She was included in the Register of Motionless Cultural Heritage of Lithuania in 1999. Apartments of some famous residents of Connors were turned into the museums. Adam Mikovich, Bali Sruoga, uses Tumas, Salome Neres, uses Zikaras, Vincenta Slatyavishis. Theatres. Connors differs in a variety of cultural life. The Connors Symphonic Orchestra, the main venue of classical musical concerts. In Connors there is an old circus tradition. At the beginning of the 19th century in the Vitovta Park in Connors the Constant Circus was founded. The only circus organization in Lithuania, the Baltic Circus, was founded in Kaunas in 1995. The Kaunas theaters play an important role in life of the Lithuanian society. There are at least seven professional theaters, a set of amateur theaters, ensembles, groups of art and sport. Examples of representatives of cultural life of Kaunas are theaters of various directions. State Academic Drama Theatre State Musical Theatre State Puppet Theatre Chamber Theatre of Youth Theatre of a Pantomime Dancing Theatre Aura Monuments and Monuments In Connors there are a lot of monuments and sculptures. 
The majority of the monuments established in corners in interwar years were destroyed during the Soviet occupation, but all were restored after restoration of the Lithuanian statehood. Partial list of monuments The Monument of Freedom 1928 Is destroyed in Soviet period 1989 Author uses Zikaris Is restored The Monument to Vitov Veliki 1932 is destroyed in Soviet period 1990 Author Vince's Gribus is restored Monument to the Lithuanian soldiers, we died for the homeland 1930 is destroyed in Soviet period it is restored 1995 Monument in memory of S. Various and S. Kiranis's flight. 1993. Ramasukalanti's monument immortalizing the place of his death. 2002. Sculpture, Soldier of Freedom. 2018. Architectural Modernism of 1919-1939 The Kwanis Interwar Architecture unites the general architectural and stylistic features reflecting modernism of the Western style. Emergence in Germany Architecture Bauhaus German of Bauhaus which sought to combine functionality with an aesthetics had the Lithuanian architects the greatest impact. Two buildings, the minimalist and rhythmically repeating architectural forms, harmony of facades and a game of geometrical figures are characteristic. However, in the Lithuanian context, he was supplemented by decorative details and national ornaments. The local style of the Kaunas modernism was created. Among buildings most of which have all reflect this style, Officers Club, the Central Post Office, the Church of Revival of Christ, the Military Museum of Vitov Veliki and others. In total for this period in Kaunas about 12,000 buildings were built. Felixis Vizbaras, 1880-1966 Vitotas Landsbergisium Kaunas 1893-1993 Edmundus Alphonsus Frikes 1876-1944 The architect of the Russian origin Vladimir Dubinetsky 1888-1932 The Latvian Carlos Racens 1894-1981 And others were the most important architects of the Kaunas modernism In March, 2015 Interwa Buildings of Corners received a solid award, the sign of the European heritage. In 2017 the Corners Interwa architecture was included in the preliminary UNESCO World Cultural Heritage list. Parks and Nature In the city there are a lot of protected areas and reserves where it is possible to find the animals included in the red list of Lithuania. The most beautiful of parks and open public spaces is Asfulinas, Pashaislis and Panamun. 7.3% of the total area of the city are allotted under parks. The Asfulinas Park, literally Old Grove, is the main public park in the center of Connors. Its area is 63 hectares, thus it is the biggest city place of growth of adult oaks in Europe. At the initiative of the Lithuanian scientists, the zoologist Tadas Ivanauskas and the biologist Konstantinas Regulis, in 1923 the Konas Botanical Garden was based. 
It serves not only as a recreational public zone, but also to show local flora. Besides in Connors, there is the Lithuanian Zoo. The only state zoo in all Lithuania is open in 1938. The territory of a zoo occupies 15.9 hectares. For protection of a unique lower landscape of the Connors Reservoir, his ecosystem and cultural heritage, the regional park of the Connors Reservoir was founded on east outskirts of Connors in 1992. Economy Connors from the middle of the 19th century developed as the industrial center. The city traditionally was considered as the center of textile, food and light industry. At the end of the 19th century the metalworking enterprises began to work. In the middle of the 20th century institutes began to work research, develops the chemical companies, branch of power. The Kaunas Hydroelectric Power Station is the largest in Lithuania. Kaunas makes 14% of all economic activity of Lithuania. In 2018 the Kaunas County created about 20% of DDD of the country. Now the accelerated rates the transport industry, services sector, tourism develops. In Connors there is a large number of shopping and entertainment centers, hotels. In the last years information technologies and electronics became a part of business activity of Connors. Besides, in the city is also available large construction companies which are engaged in commercial, housing and road construction. The main foreign investors in Connors are the companies from Sweden, the USA, Finland, Estonia, Germany and Denmark. The main offices of several large international and Lithuanian companies are located in Connors, including concern on production of the packed food, Kraft Foods Lituva, the largest producer of universal pharmaceutical medicines in Lithuania, Sanitas, the producer of sportswear of AB, Odimas, Yitkosta Construction Company, one of the largest companies in Lithuania which is engaged in wholesale trade of Senukai. The producer of hard alcoholic beverages, largest in Lithuania, Stumbras, Wolfus Engelmann Brewery, the confectionery company, Phaser Gardasis, producer of pharmaceutical medicines and drugs in Lithuania in Akonitam. Thanks to the geographical location, Kaunas is considered one of the largest logistic centers in Lithuania. Here the largest wholesale and distributor and logistic company in Lithuania works. Sanitex In Connors there are also several innovative companies, such as leading wholesale dealer in the computer components, Acme Group, provider of the internet and television of, Microvis Auto Group, the developer and producer of original products for television of, Celteca. Connors is also known for the programmers. In the city the Division on Research and Development of Ubiquiti Networks Europe was created. Connors is also the host for Boltaius program in Iranga, which makes the world's leading tools for modeling of the software. In 2011 the plant on assembly of lead lighting was opened in Connors by the South Korean company, Late Technology. The Connors Free Economic Zone created in 1996 also attracted many important foreign investors. In 2017 the producer of automobile spare parts and technologies Continental AD decided to invest more than 95 million euros in construction of the new plant in Connors. Now Lituvos Energija together with Fortum Company of Heat builds the 200 million Kaunas cogeneration power plant. Heat PPF. Transport. In the city there is the oldest passenger long distance bus station in Lithuania as founded in 1928. 
In 2017 it is reconstructed. Wapkokra, one of the largest Lithuanian passenger carriers by buses, transports passengers on the international and local routes. Kaunas, large knot of highways. Through the city roads of national value and the European highways crossing Lithuania run. E. Helsinki, Tallinn, Riga, Kaunas, Warsaw, Prague. E. Klaipeda, Kaunas, Vilnius, Dilid, Shunivtsi, Bucharest, Alexandropoli. E. Kaunas, Akmerch, Togavpils, Rizekni, the island. City transport. In Kaunas systems bus. 49 routes. And trolleybus. 16 routes. The messages connecting everything parts of the city and the vicinity work. Payment is made by means of prepaid tickets which can be bought in booths or from the driver. Since 2007 it is possible to acquire the e-ticket valid in city public transport, using the internet phone, aids or for cash money. Fare minus 1 euro. 2019. The hilly relief of the city promoted opening in the 1938 years of funiculars in the areas of Julia Kaunas. 1931. And Alexotis. 1935. Funiculars is one of the oldest still working in Europe and have technological and architectural value. At the beginning of the odd years funiculars underwent capital repairs and continue to be used both as the vehicle and as a tourist attraction. They looks precisely as in nearly a century ago. The funiculars constructed by the German firm AD have the following characteristics. Car capacity up to 35 people. Time of the movement about one and a half minutes. Julia Kalnes. A tilt angle 1439A, length minus 142M. Alexotis. A tilt angle 1800A, length minus 133M. Vikonas International Airport, the second airport on passenger transportations in Lithuania. It is constructed in the Kaunas district at the settlement of Karmalava in 1988. In 2005 it is modernized. Significant improvement of air transport connection with Western Europe made Kaunas easily available to foreign tourists. The airport is in 13 kilometers from the center of Kaunas. It is possible to reach by direct flights from the Kaunas International Airport 11 countries of the world. The Ryanair airline chose on May 4, 2010 the Kaunas airport as the first main destination in the region. The airport is in Department of the Ministry of the Message of the Republic of Lithuania. Since 1915 in Kaunas the oldest airfield in Lithuania S. Darius and S. Gurinas also works. Now the airfield is generally used for sports and tourist aircraft. The Kaunas railway station, not of several railway lines. The Connors Railway Tunnel, the first and the only operating tunnel in the Baltic States, was constructed in 1862. Now by rail Vilnius, Connors electric passenger trains go. The main station of sorting and distribution of freights of the Connors Railroad works at the railway station Polamonas. Science and Education Connors is often called the city of students. In Kaunas, six higher educational institutions in which about 35,000 students study are open. 
The first parish school was mentioned in Connors in 1473. In 1649 in Connors the first four great school of Jesuits was open. The oldest of the operating higher educational institutions is the Connors Seminary of Priests created in 1864. The qualitatively new stage of development of education in Connors began after restoration of the Lithuanian statehood. In 1922 the first higher educational institution in Connors, the Lithuanian University which in 1930 was renamed into the Vitovta Velikogo University was solemnly open. In the city there is a large number of the public and private schools, gymnasiums and progymnasiums. Connors also has numerous libraries. The most important of them is the Connors Public Library is created in 1919. Now the library of the Connors region stores more than two, two million volumes of books. In Connors there is also a Valley of Santuk, the center of researches and experimental developments of open access meeting the international standards, uniting the research capacity of prospective areas, chemical and biopharmaceutical technologies, power information and communication technologies. Vitovta Velikogo University Connors Technological University Alexandra Stolginskisa University Connors University of Applied Sciences Lithuanian University of Sciences of Health Lithuanian Sports University Connors Humanitarian Faculty of Vilnius University University of Mykola's Ramaris Faculty of Public Safety Connors Art Faculty of the Vilnius Art Academy the sport in Connors has long a knee story. In the city different types of sport actively developed in interwar years. In Connors there are several historical clubs such as Connors Football Club 1920 Connors Baseball Club of Elfiels 1922 Zulgiris Basketball Club 1944 The hockey was for the first time played in Lithuania in 1922. 1921 the Connors municipality leased a ground to the Lithuanian Union of Physical Culture where the football field and racetracks were established. The first and independent Lithuania sports stadium was opened for 1924 at the initiative of Stepanas Darius. Stadium of S. Various and S. Purinus. Capacity, more than 90 hundred people. 1934 The Palace of Physical Training built near stadium is the operating Lithuanian Sports University. 1939 In Connors the Europe's first arena which is specially built for basketball opened. The most popular sport in Connors, basketball. The first basketball match in the city was held in 1922. The basketball became especially popular after the victory of Lithuania in 1937 in the European Basketball Championship. The oldest and the most titled Connors men's basketball club is Zulgiris. In Connors were born and many Lithuanian stars of basketball among which there are Arvidas Sabonis, Sharunas Markulionis, Remus Kurtinatis, Zidranas Ilgauskas, Linus Klaza and Sharunas Yosikiavishis spent the childhood. The main stadium of the city, Stadium of S. Various and S. Purinas. Capacity, more than 90 hundred people. In the present basketball matches go to Zalgiris Arena which was constructed in 2011. 
It is the largest multipurpose arena in the Baltic countries. Capacity, more than 15400 people. In May 2018, Sharunas Yasikiavishis, being a coach of Zulgiris, I became the honorable citizen of Konas. In interwar years in Lithuania also began to play soccer. The men's national team of Lithuania on soccer played the first international tournament in 1923. The Konas clubs repeatedly became champions of Lithuania in soccer. The repeated champion of Lithuania, Ebik Konas. In 2011 the National Football Academy was created. In the regional park of the Corners Reservoir Sailing Competitions Roviditsia. Famous inhabitants and natives. Adam Nikovich. 1798-1855. Is the Polish-Lithuanian poet. Maronis. 1862-1932 is the Lithuanian poet, the outstanding representative of the Lithuanian Romanticism, the Catholic priest. Mstislav Dobyshinsky, 1875-1957 the Russian and the Lithuanian artist. Mitchell Romer, 1880-1945 is the Lithuanian lawyer, the social and political figure. One of ideologists of restoration of independence of Lithuania. Tadas Ivanaskas, 1882-1970. Is the Lithuanian zoologist, the academician. Varvara Stepanova, 1894-1958. Is the Soviet artist avant-gardist, Alexander Rodchenko's wife. Ben Shang, 1898-1969. Is the American artist and the photographer. Emmanuel Levines, 1906-1995. Is the French ethical philosopher. Maria Gimbutas, 1921-1994. The Lithuanian and American archaeologist. The culturologist. Donatus Banionis. 1924-2014. Is the Soviet and Lithuanian stage and film actor. Valdes Adamkes. I was born. 1926. The former president of Lithuania. Algemantis Nesvitis. 1928-2018 Is the Lithuanian architect professor Ergis Machines 1931-1978 Is the Lithuanian and American artist, one of founders in the art fluxus current Vitotas Landsbergis I was born 1932 the Lithuanian politician, the public figure. Honorary Chairman of the Lithuanian Political Movement for Independence of Sayudas. Idris uses podcast. I was born. 1937. The Lithuanian Cardinal and the Vatican diplomat. Stasis Povilatis. 1947-2015 Is the Lithuanian crooner Talent 1953-1972 Romos, the Lithuanian dissident It became known after the act of self-immolation in protest at the Soviet power in Lithuania It is awarded posthumously the Order Vitus's Cross the primate Curtinatus. I was born. 1960. The Lithuanian professional basketball player and the trainer. Sharunas Markulionis. I was born. 1964. 
the Lithuanian professional basketball player. Arvidas Sabonis. I was born. 1964. The Lithuanian professional basketball player. Arturis Zvokas. I was born. 1968. The Lithuanian politician and the businessman, the former mayor of Vilnius. Sharunas Yasikiavishis. I was born. 1976. The Lithuanian professional basketball player and the trainer. Milutaitsru. I was born. 1997. The former Lithuanian swimmer, the Olympic champion. Vitaltas Landsbergis Jankalnis. 1893-1993. Is the Lithuanian architect, the public and political figure. Bernardas Bradzianis. 1907-2002 Is the Lithuanian poet and the critic Vincentis Slatjavicius 1920-2000 Is the Lithuanian cardinal Stasis Lozaretis 1924-1994 Is the Lithuanian diplomat and the political figure Also far Write comments. Read comments. Interesting people will tell interesting stories. All of good mood and good luck.